Warning, this video may contain foul language and crude humor and is meant for an adult audience. Please be advised. Hello and welcome to another edition of War Journal Toys. I am Jason, your toy vigilante, here to be your forward observer in your toy hunting missions. Let's debrief. <clears throat> Today we're going to be looking at Masters of the Universe, Spydor, Evil Stalker in a vintage box. Let's get into this. So, wanted to highlight this today. I got it at an angle because of the glare from my light would shine off the box and you would not appreciate it. So, we're highlighting my Masters of the Universe Spider Evil Stalker toy. I have the toy and the box. <clears throat> this one I wanted to highlight because if I wanted to let you guys know if they re-release this thing this thing's going to get expensive it's going to be hard to find um i've seen this thing sealed in the box right now for four and five hundred dollars this one was not sealed in the box obviously you can see that the flap is open but they did a really nice job they didn't glue it too hard so it opened really easy but it's a really nice box Got the toy there with Skeletor, Battle Armor Skeletor, and Man at Arms. Spydor, incredible walking creature with amazing mechanical legs. And you get another shot of the artwork on the top, plus the description underneath. Same thing. Both sides have man at arms. Same photography. Now the back is in pretty good condition too because it's full color. And luckily, whoever had it did not put it somewhere to turn it because I've seen these brown and yellowed and really crinkled. This one is in pretty damn good condition for being. 1984 so it's not quite it's almost 40 years old but you've got the description of the creature moves forward and backwards spring action claw can carry a figure in the the mandibles see-through gearbox lets you watch it work creature really walks stalks enemy of Skeletor, not with use with some figures, removable guns, and that the figure can use. Figure rides in cockpit, mounted gun rotates for battle, and then push switch to move forward or backward. So that's the box. Turn it to the right side out here and then it mine did include the the instructions which usually these things start at about 25 bucks for a set and this was included and another reason I wanted to pick this up now this one I did pay a little bit more of a premium but that what I thought the box was well well worth it so, mind you, the original price tag on it from Woolworth was $29.99 back in whatever year they ended up selling this. So, there's the box. Now, here's the loose guy. I am missing one gun. Which I'll have to pick that up on eBay. But you can see I got his... His eyes are intact and not broken. His jaws aren't missing or broken either. And they move. This thing is actually really cool. If you don't like spiders, you might not want to pick this up. 
but it's kind of cool that too that I have the battle the new battle armor He-Man and the battle armor Skeletor that's like there is also the new one here so you get your six legs and right now I will turn this on so you can watch it go forward come on boy these batteries might not be the best they use C batteries and it goes forward and backward so that's kind of cool and then I'll have it work walk towards the camera pull that out of the way so like I said it's a cool toy I would recommend you guys go out and pick up yours before they get too expensive um, they come in a variety of shapes uh, condition as I should say because some don't have the gun sometimes these are broken sometimes the eyes are broken sometimes these are missing sometimes the battery hatches that are on the bottom are missing but this one is pretty good condition it's, I'm probably gonna have to spend about 20 something dollars on a replacement gun but What do you call it? I'm just glad. I'm like I said, I have this, but I also have the box, and the box is in really great condition. So, what do you guys call it? I I usually collect the bad guy vehicles, and this one came up and was available at a reasonable price compared to what stuff has been going for lately. So I picked it up, and I picked it up off eBay. Be patient. Look around. There's boxes in all sorts of conditions, but uh, you, I'm sure if you guys have the patience and watch, you, you can find one that you can pick up and be happy with, like I did. So, keep your eyes peeled. Um, if you guys like my content, please like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one. Thanks.